one, uh, obviously we've got the uh, vehicle on the launch stand. The next operation is hazardous ops when we start uh, loading the fuel, uh, but uh, everything's going well. Comm checks are good and uh, we are live for a launch. We're ready to uh, put some really important payloads up and uh, look forward to doing this on a much more frequent basis in the near future. Excelsi, arm ignition sequence. Excelsi, ignition sequence is armed. Excelsi, engage auto start sequence at T minus two seconds. Excelsi, standing by. XSO, begin 15 second countdown. This is XSO, the range is go, and we'll commence on my 15 mark. 15 10 5 4 3 2 1 ignition Sorry for the shaky video, I'm super zoomed in. This is XSO, He's the way up there. The main vehicle is under shoot and we're dumping propellants to reduce the weight so it should come down soft. It looks like the GPS steerable chute is moving around in the sky so she should try and recover close to the lift off point. To the tripod. This could take a little while guys. It typically takes uh, quite a bit to return to its landing spot because it has to burn off all of its fuel and it's just going with the wind at this point. It's just a little paraglide parachute. So it's going to steer its way back to its primary landing location, which it actually has exclusion zones and secondary and a tertiary landing location if needed. It attempts the primary first and we can actually communicate with it and it'll tell us if it thinks it can make that primary location. If it can't, uh, we'll direct it to the secondary, but it always tries for the primary. Well, the exclusion zones are like, you know, there's some buildings out here we don't want it landing on top of or our launch site. And so that is excluded from the landing area. Um, there's some security personnel and it, the rocket will actually avoid those locations. Oh, and we have touchdown. All right, everyone. So uh, that was a nominal flight. Obviously, we had a performance uh, challenge on our gimbal control for one reason or the other. Uh, very, very uh, sad day. However, any day that you recover a rocket, it is a good day. 